Today's video and blog topic are on PTSD. PTSD is a mental health condition caused by trauma. It stands for Post Traumatic Stress Disorder. Trauma includes serious injuries or accidents, abuse, loss of a parent or loved one, violence, shootings, or being a target for hate. These can cause trauma in the person experiencing them or in someone who witnessed the experience. Trauma doesn't always cause PTSD, but it can. This is when trauma takes over someone's ability to cope. Whether or not this woman develops PTSD can be determined by how severe the trauma was, having depression or anxiety, or how soon they get help. Signs of PTSD include having nightmares, flashbacks, being easily startled, and memory blocks towards the trauma. Having these reactions in the first few days or weeks after the trauma is normal, that is an acute stress reaction. When the symptoms last longer than a month, that's when it's diagnosed as PTSD. Treatments include medicines for anxiety or depression or therapy. Therapy for kids with just PTSD is called TFCBT. Trauma forced cognitive behavioral therapy. For teens, therapy could be cognitive processing therapy or prolonged exposure to help lower anxiety about the topic that caused trauma. If you're helping someone who's experienced trauma and has PTSD, what can you do? Well, help them feel safe by pro providing extra time or care as needed and help them relax by reminding them to take calm breaths. You can also do things that you enjoy to take their mind off of it. If possible, you can let their doctor and or teacher know about the incident so they're aware of triggers and why their behavior may be different. Also, remember that they can talk to God about their trauma. Psalm chapter 107, verse 13 through 16. Then they cried to the Lord in their trouble, and he delivered them from their distress. He brought them out of darkness in the shadow of death and burst their bonds apart. Let them thank the Lord for his steadfast love, for his wondrous works to the children of man. For he shatters the doors of bronze and cuts in two bars of iron. This is the end of the mental health topic. Starting during the next blog, I'll be back to normal topics. See you again next week with a new video and blog topic.